Investigator 18 year old motorcyclist was traveling at a high rate of speed right before a crash that killed his 18 year old passenger. We showed you the scene last night. This happened near North Broadway and Old Lincoln Highway just after 8. Joseph Goodwin died, but the bike kept going, hitting another motorcyclist in oncoming traffic. KTV News Watch 7's Christina Engdahl's live with this developing story. And Melissa, the driver, 18 year old John Harder, is still in the hospital. And the woman that bike hit, 67 year old Catherine Kennan, is in serious condition. Our neighbors, we we spoke with say the layout of the road is no place for going fast. Yes, it was quite a quite a nightmare. Randy Millman heard a motorcycle accelerate and knew something was about to happen. It hit probably around 100 miles an hour easily and that's when I said there's going to be an accident. Got up here to the corner and boom. He says going fast in a 45 mile per hour zone is all too common on the old Lincoln Highway. They think it's a playground out here, and it's not. It's a highway. The Pottawatomie County Sheriff's Office says the driver, John Harder, lost control of his high-performance motorcycle Tuesday night while passing another vehicle right before a curve. Way too much traffic for the speed they're running. Jim James came home to find the crash near his yard. It's just knew it was going to happen sometime, just didn't know when. Because the people fly up and down through here with their on motorcycles all the time. You know, just, wah, just flying. The former rider himself knows that curves can be exciting. Well, you know, that's fun. But there's too much traffic for that anymore. And the dangers they bring. Slow down is the biggest thing. You can't run 100 mile an hour in a 50 mile zone and expect not to have something happen to you. You are human and you can be broke real hard, real quick. Don't take long to learn that lesson. It's a lesson Randy Millman is already teaching his son. Be aware, look ahead, and be smart. Think about your own life and the people that love you. Because if you don't, something could happen. Now, again, the driver, John Harder, is still in the hospital. A family member we spoke with says the teen has road rash all over his body. And again, the other motorcyclist, Catherine Kennan, is in serious condition. Melissa. All right, Christina, thank you. We